look, our next guest is a true national treasure. She made a name in comedy and musical theatre uh, for 40 years. And now here she is, Sue Pollard. She's making her debut at the Edinburgh Fringe Festival in her new play called Harpy, where audiences will get to see a more serious side. Is this true, Sue? Oh, yes, totally. I don't look anything like I do, usually like this. She's not dressed in anything like this. There's no glasses. She's kind of... A bit sombre, simply because of her character. You see, she is a hoarder, harpy it's called, simply because that's, like, synonymous with some sort of mythical character years ago. And basically, it, it, it's a lovely show because it's got all the emotions in it about how people actually make assumptions. You could mm. see somebody in a supermarket and say and think they look absolutely stunning and fabulous but they actually probably live into what they would think is squalor but to her it's not everything that she's ever had in her life was either it means that she's she's meant something to herself and to the world and it's lonely she doesn't want to let it go no absolutely not mm. and so many people and you say to yourself actually how long does a present last it's true, it isn't it? If you've got a present that you're not using, yeah. but you love the person who gave it to you and you know it was given with love, yeah. you can't get rid of it, can no, you? No, absolutely this not. This is terribly grown up, though, you know. Oh, you're on the stage in Edinburgh. No, it's marvellous. Are oh, you going to Edinburgh? Oh, yes. And Well, I like Edinburgh, but you know, sometimes, babe, it's really nice. You do look have. different. We've just yeah. got a picture of you. Because we know fan. you for all the comedy roles, yes. don't we? So how big a leap is it for you, then, doing this role that's more serious? Well, it's interesting, because years ago, I used to do a lot more play and then, of course, I got um, Heidi Hyde, which has a fantastic springboard. And I liked it because the thing is, it's about time for me now. It's a good piece. You know what I'm saying? It's you're going to get time. your teeth into. I don't. I, you shouldn't mention a woman's age, but you're coming up to a rather big birthday, aren't you? And yeah. how do you, you're so bubbly, or the same as ever you were? How do you do it? Well, I don't know. I suppose I'm lucky. I'm just lucky because I know that I've got good things in life, and mm. I never take for granted what I've got, really. And the thing is, look, darling, nobody wants to hide under a bush when they see one coming. You know, somebody else, oh, God, I've got to go and say hello to him. He's That's very not... true, so, and you're good on it. Yeah, you want, to be po you want to be a bit positive and just give somebody... Great note to everyone. Well, you're but more than a bit hoping, positive. But good luck for Edinburgh, Sue. It's been lovely seeing you. Thank you. Thank you. Good luck at Edinburgh. We look forward to seeing that. Thanks.